Yeah, it's exciting. It's uh, I moved away from the Portland area about two and a half, three, three years ago, back to Kansas City. So it's uh, it's always nice to get back to the Portland area, especially when the weather's like this. Um, so I miss being out here at the training facility in the stadium, but get back here every few months. So excited about the match tomorrow. Obviously, it's nice that Chara decided to pick me at some point, so we get to hopefully pair up at one point in the in the midfield and and play with some other folks with Christine Sinclair and stuff. So it's, I think it's a it's a, it's an op awesome opportunity uh, for the players to have some fun in a different capacity and, and not as serious. Um, intermix the groups and uh, for me, it's it's fun to be back on the pitch. I haven't I haven't played in really any games since probably 2016. So and hopefully, there's not a lot of expectations out there other than not not getting hurt. I was going to ask, how, how's your game feeling these days? But it doesn't sound like there's not good. Other than coaching my my 12 year old daughter, uh, those are about the only touches I get. Uh, every week is there, but no, it'll be it'll be exciting again. I have, even with the the expansion to the stadium, I was there working with the club and the front office side, but haven't haven't stepped out there and played in a in a match um, with those additional seats. So again, anytime you step across those lines on that stadium, it's a special moment. So I'm excited to to get back to Portland and and just like today, it's great to see Espria and Chara and some of these guys that you play with that are that are still holding strong. Um, so kudos to them for keeping themselves healthy and then getting an opportunity to play against some of them tomorrow with you know some of the newer guys that are here with the Vander and even on the Thorn side with Sophia Smith. So I promise to not kick any of them or hurt any of them. I will walk around and, and do my best just to, to pass the ball sideways and backwards. What, 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 what's it mean to you to come back to like a club in a city where when you do interview, do interviews, you're introduced as like a club legend, and you know you kind of have that that resume to it. I know you've been retired for a little bit now, but yeah. you know to like have a little bit of perspective on your Portland career. Like, what's what's that mean to you? Yeah, I mean it it means a lot. I think when I was traded here in 2011, I had never visited Portland. I knew nothing of it, um, and so to be embraced by the community and the fans the way I was over my six years playing and then 10 years as a whole with four four years on the business side too. It it, uh, it means a lot. It makes it special to come back, um, to see some fans and familiar faces that you saw when you were playing um, or working with the club. Um, even Jill, you know, her and I work together at the club, so it's, it's cool to come back here after a few years of not seeing each other and it's like, you don't, you don't miss a beat. So I think those are the, the friendships and stuff that you, that you miss um, when you step away from the game. So um, it means a lot. I, you know, I don't see myself in that light, but it's nice that the club values players that, that did come here and, and start their time at the MLS era the same way that they do with the, the team back in the 70s and the way they built the history of this club. How, how special is, you know, is feeling to play with the, you know, the teammates as Val Valeria? Yeah, you know, I haven't, you know, I haven't seen Valeria in a couple years, so it'll be good to, to see him tomorrow. I know we're playing against each other, so I might kick him a little bit harder because him and I can get hurt, just the rest of them can't. Um, so it's again, it's special. I just was talking to Char. I'm like, it's incredible that he's 38 years old and and still buzzing around the field and tackling and doing all the things that he's always done for so many years when when we were together. Um, so it's uh, it'll be a fun day, hopefully for everyone. And I'm guessing the fans are hoping that it's like 20 to 15 tomorrow because I promise there probably won't be a lot of defending going on. <laughs> yeah, that's the other two. Their score prediction for the game. Do you have one? I would let's hope for double digits on one. How long is the game? I don't even. Sixty minutes. Sixty minutes. Okay, so maybe that. Let's go like seven to four. Good guys, green team. Perfect.